yeah guys welcome back to the blended bias family and uh, my name is tony as you know and thank you for subscribing to our channel liking our video sharing our video and um, commenting on our videos we really do appreciate and if you haven't subscribed to our channel please do you're missing a you're missing a bunch of discussion we usually do our channel is for uplifting encouraging each other through our journey of life that's the purpose of this channel and if you have any question about us if you want us to do anything special feel free to comment feel free to ask, ask us any question we have a facebook page we have an instagram tiktok any avenue you feel like you're comfortable with hit us with your question and comments and we would love to hear from you thank you for over 1000 subscribers and uh, all the likes and views we really do appreciate on uh, today's video i wanted to talk about something that is very common in today's society that is depression depression has been a very major challenge in uh, our daily life as youth and uh, so many youths in uh, modern days are facing depression due to so many reasons and i might say is not even about depression itself is how to cope with the forces that we are facing in the world that bring about the depression that we have in our youths in in day-to-day -day life and most of this depression or most of these uh, things that are contributing to depression and making so making us lose so many youths is just something that if we talk about them we can be able to curb and we can be able to prevent in our daily life you know depression is a very big thing that you cannot see it you can not even uh, because you can have a friend who's have who's going through depression and you cannot even know because it's something internally in your mind and somebody cannot see it. and some people can pre pre pretend you cannot even know they are undergoing a lot of things unless you are so close to them that they can share and what do you do in a certain point when you when you discover your friend is in depression we need to talk to each other openly and even stop criticizing things that we like to normalize and joke about like you see somebody who's uh, big you call them fat that's not a good thing because you're contributing to somebody's downfall you so you see somebody who's failing instead of encouraging them you talk about them and there's one thing i would like to say and of our all of or already I've said in my previous videos, if some people are not there to encourage you in your life, let them go. I might use a term you don't like, but F them. I say that for real. Because what are they there in your life for? Because a friend in need is a friend indeed somebody who is there to support you they have they don't have to be financially capable to help you but they can give you some ideas that can uplift your life and that's where we are lacking nowadays because we are living in an era of internet i might say internet facebook instagram tiktok we see and then we want to emulate we see and then we want to follow and those things lead to depression and since depression is something that is not physical we cannot even see like the there are a lot of things goes in your mind you cannot even sometimes is denial we can deny so much and it end up affecting our life don't die or with depression you have to talk if you have something that you feel you think you have an idea 
Now, you think something is uh, pressing your heart or pressing your feelings, you have to talk. Anyway, most of people, most people we have friends. And not everything you have to tell your friend. But we also have an avenue of this internet that giving us depression that can also help us. You can all you can always type motivational thing or depression thing. They can always give you material that you can read and go through them and uh, find some study thing that can help you in life. But you have to be super, super, super open because for you to encounter or to face depression, you have to be open to yourself. You have to be true to yourself. And let me give you one thing, one thing in life. You are only you and you can only be you. You cannot be another person no matter how you try to imitate. And that's what one thing, one thing, that's one thing that's killing us with depression. We want to be somebody else. Don't try to be somebody else. Be you. Love you. Regardless of what people are saying. I don't care what, like, let me give you a very simple story of myself. So, I relocated to America in the year 2011. I came and lived in Longview, Texas for all these years. I haven't, I haven't left this little town called Longview, Texas. And I love it. You know why? Most people come to this town for college, Kilgore College, Tala Junior College, and other places. And they come and go. And I have been stuck here for all that long. And I love it. Because I came to a realization. I don't have to go with masses of people, what they do. I have to be me. And it has really helped me in life. At one point, I was so much depressed. And I was thinking about, what am I doing here? Let me go back to Kenya. I'm not going to finish school. Let me know. Because it's, it's too much because I have to work. I have to get this money. I have Kenya calling me, my, my, my family. I have Like, it was too much. But when I came to realization, there's only one Tony. And I had a son who depend on me. If I'm not here, who's going to take care of that boy? And if I'm not here, who's another Tony? People call me Kazungu. Who's another Kazungu? So I had to think and think and think and say, you know what? I got to do me. And if you don't like me, hell yeah. I'm sorry. Bye. And that's what I did. And I'm super happy about what I do. What I post in my social media, in my Facebook, in my Instagram. I don't shiva get what you say about it. Whether you like it or you don't like it. There, I'm living my life. So, if you want to conquer depression, be you. Don't try to emulate any other person because that will kill you. That will bring you down. Let people say, you know what? People will never stop talking about anything. People will never stop talking. That's why positive news, if you see news saying good things, they don't never sell. I was watching on the video. I, the, I love Kenyan music. I listen to Ken, my little baby listen to Kenyan music. I love Kenyan music. I have this, uh, I listen to this Kenyan Hope Kid music hall in Jili. Hope Kid. Man, that music is dope. Why are not, why are people not listening to that music? And they're listening to other, other one I cannot say. I don't want to criticize other because I say what I love. And then this guardian angel, he has so many music I listen to. Why? So you have to open yourself, start loving yourself, still, and you will have a happy life because depression is killing my. Still, my friends, I, I will say when I was in Kenya, I had two friends of mine. And um, when I came here, I had to talk because, you know, people don't realize when you came to America, you face so many things. And uh, before you, you, you attain the level that you want, it takes a lot of effort and years. It takes a lot of sleepless nights. People don't realize that. 
People back home think we come here, we climb a tree, we get dollars. We don't do that. It's sleepless night. Sleepless night. I hate like four years, four years. I came here 10 years. I graduated on my 10th year. I'm not going to be ashamed of saying that. Because I have to work night and go to school during the day, do prerequisites, fail. After I fail, I start thinking about what, what did I do wrong? And that's money wasted. It's a lot of money invested there. And then I went back to school and when I went back to school, I was ready. Do you know what? And when I started giving, not giving her shit to other people's stuff, my GPA was 4.0 when I was graduating. And it still is, and I'm going back to school. Because I had decided this is what I want, and I did not listen to. Because people were telling me lies. No, you cannot do it. Oh, nothing is hard. That's why you're failing. I, I was listening to people. But when I stop listening to people, man, I tell you, man, I can show you. My graduation picture is up here. Yes, this is me. I did make it. I didn't make it. I can show you my GPA. There's not many people who make it. Even those people who are talking about me, I don't think they have the GPA, that my GPA. So, depression is real. Stop repressing yourself by listening to other people. I love you. The blended fire family love you. Anybody can make it in life. Just be you. Thank you for rocking in in our channel, subscribing, and uh, commenting on our channel. And if you have not subscribed to our channel, please do. We love you. Till next time.